Yeah, it's good. <laughs> I just, I just like sit here and like listen to this for a second because god damn mm -hmm. uh oh wait i need to change to currently playing Finished Ghost Trick, no need to replay it now. Um, uh, how does it, how does it, like this? Yep, I don't know how that's pronounced, nor do I know what it means, but... This is the title of the game. Alright, let's start. Yes, I know. Presented by Yandere Lover. Up. Wake up, Mitaro. I swear every single name, every single main character has a row at the end. <laughs> every main character is some sort of Taro. It's already morning. Hurry up and wake up, your breakfast is going to cool down. It's morning. Mom came to wake me up. I got my lazy body up and put my put on my clothes. After breakfast, it was time for my boss to pick me up. I'll be waiting for you while making your favorite rice omelets. Have a good day, dear. Thanks, see you. I got on the bus to my kindergarten. God damn, I cannot escape kindergarten, can I? I'm sure it will be a wonderful day like usual at my favorite kindergarten. The innocence of a child is frightening. That's why. That's why. That's just a fucking... <laughs> Morning, Mitaro-kun. How are you? This girl is Kotomi-chan, my only friend at kindergarten. A cute little girl. Let's have a lot of fun today together, Mitaro. Let's go, the morning meeting is going to start soon. Also, I just realized chat is broken. Um, There we go. There we go. Ah, uh, can I? There we go. What are you doing, Slowpoke? Can't you hear me, piece of shit? Hurry up now! I was pulled by Kotomi into the school. Kotomi grabbed my, grabbed my hand tight, so I didn't resist. Even after the morning meeting was over, I was still getting teased by Kotomi. Hey, hey, Mitaro-kun. What are you doing here? What? Okay. 
What? <laughs> it's Minami Town. You really like that shitty bitch. God damn. She does not fuck around. Wow, she's a stupid girl. I want to choke her with, with flashy pink stockings and wake her up. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with her? You may think like that because you've never seen the bad side of her. She's a three-timing shitty bitch. That's ugly and fat. She's always making that air-headed personality. Don't you think that's so shitty? You were fooled by that act by that acting, weren't you? What a poor thing. You could have noticed that. What a poor boy. Poor, poor virgin boy. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I thought we were in kindergarten. <laughs> I get angry just because she's breathing air. I hope she disappears. Oh, I have an idea. Hey, you dickhead. Why don't you steal her panties? Oh my god. Why the unpleasant look? You like her, don't you? You don't want to do it? No way. Show me your real self. You can do it. Right, Mitaro-kun? <laughs> bitch. It's lunchtime. Every everyone is having their mom's handmade lunch. What's inside my lunchbox today? I'm excited. Hehehe, <laughs> lunch is yummy. Don't you think so too, Mitaroken? What's inside your lunchbox today? Oh, it's hamburger. That hamburger. Is it handmade? It looks yummy. Can I have a bite? It's okay, right? Give it to me. You have any problems? Don't worry, I will evaluate the taste. Why, you say? Because it's normal for me to do this. Yeah, huh? Because I'm hungry, of course. In the end, Kotomi took my lunch. I'm hungry. What a bitch. You can talk shit all you want, but you don't steal my lunch. <gasps> USA! USA is a nationwide common save point. Care to save? Yes! My boy. Saved. Uh, it's break time. At this time, everyone plays and does whatever they want. I was... I was hiding in the toilet and playing games. Then I found... Then I was found by... Uh, fuck. Then I was found out by Kotomi-chan. Oh, there's a disgusting otaku. <laughs> Oops, it was Mitaro-kun. Of course it was intentional. Don't make me laugh. Oh-ho. You shouldn't bring video games to school, Mitaro-kun. Hey, I won't tell anyone, so please let me play the game. Let me see, let me see. What? This thing is boring. What a shitty game. What is this? You spent your money on this thing? You're so weird. By the way, why are you playing it? Is this your life or something? It's just a game with cute characters to hook ugly otakus, isn't it? The content is so boring and shitty. Even you know that it's a shitty game, right? The people that made it, that made this must know that too. If you don't want to do it, then you shouldn't play it. Stop complaining about it, you ugly, shy, lousy boy. Even if you complain about it, your reality won't change. After all, you are just a monster face. <laughs> Why would you do something about your looks? God damn, I thought she was my friend, but no. <laughs> in the end, you're just going to throw this away, right? You're going to put it in a trash once you're tired of it, right? I don't even know how much time it took to make this game. It looks like no one put effort into it. You can do min meaningless things however you like. You stupid brats here and there. It's just a joke. This angel Kotomi-chan wouldn't think of this, of such a thing, mm-hmm. Sorry, sorry, Mitaro-kun. Are you angry? What a saucy little brat. What a slap- Oh, plunk. The game that Kotomi- 
was holding has been dropped into the toilet. Oops, my hand slipped. Puncher. Punter into the stratosphere. Oh, my, my, Mitaro-kun's important game is going to sink. I was thinking that this garbage should go in the trash, and it really happened. It went into the water where everyone poops and pees. Into the very dirty, dirty water. Into the water with so many germs. I guess you have to put your hands inside to get it. You can do it, Mitaro-kun. What happened, Mitaro-kun? Your hands are shaking. Is it okay if your game gets so wet? If you don't hurry, it's going to break. Is it really alright? <laughs> Teacher, this way. Look, Mitaro-kun and Kotomi-chan are... She's cute. Can she be my friend instead? What happened between you two? What's the matter? Are you fighting? Oh, Miss Ayano. No, nothing to worry about. It's alright. You were deciding when we should play outside. Well, you two are really good friends. You always play together, right? That's right. We always were good buddies. There is nothing to worry about. I'm glad that there is nothing wrong with you two. Everyone be nice to each other, okay? It's time for drawing. I really like to draw because last lesson, mom and the teacher praised me for the good work. I'm going to draw more time. Uh, I'm going to draw more today. Huh? Drawing. So exhausting and boring. Wow, Mitaro. You're really good at drawing, that's so cool. Wow, what a saucy, shy, shy brat. I can't do such a thing. <laughs> but don't you think this talent won't be useful in the future? Can you live by yourself just by drawing? You have to make your talent better than anybody else to be a part of society. You're just a beginner, so you shouldn't dream of becoming something yet. You can't be famous and your name won't be remembered. So only people who really worked hard, had talent or luck to make their dreams come true. You're just a bastard that can't do anything, so you have to live quietly just for, just for yourself. You shouldn't dream of becoming something, or else you'll be squished by the... by the thugs. So you have to live realistically. That's... the first actual piece of advice that she gives. <laughs> That's the only thing I actually agree with. Emo boys like you should live more emo, like cutting your hand or something. God damn. Okay, maybe not that part. That's, not, that's something I would do. Don't do that. Hey, hey, what do you feel now? How do you feel getting your dreams destroyed? Even if you keep working so hard, you'll be thrown out like a dirty old rag in the end. We humans are just disposable. Our future is pitch black. Why was I even born into this world? It's all the adults' fault, right? We were just born, so we, so we're not the ones at fault, right? As soon as I thought so, I became something like a living pollution, always bothering my parents. Life is so interesting. What a pleasant world. Life is so fun. I'm tired. I don't want to talk anymore. Nah, so unpleasant, boring. Go away, Mitaro. But Kotomi was the one who started talking to me. I thought as I walked away from her. I want to kick her in the face.
It's time for cleaning. We work together and try to clean our school. I will try my best. When I was cleaning, Kotomi suddenly started talking to me. Mitaro, don't you think cleaning is so wonderful? It makes your heart clean too. Hey, don't you think so? Don't you think so? Say yes, you piece of shit. Where's the no option? I'm doing the wonderful, wonderful toilet cleaning. Your heart might become the cleanest up in the world if you do this job. Because of the little brats in the toilet... Because of the little brats, the toilet is so dirty. It's so smelly. Help me do something. Can't you guys use it more cleaner? Brats should hurry up and uh, do their thing and go to bed. So, what did I want, want to say? You know it already, right? Shut up and take over my job. Do you want to get killed? Yep, yep. Slaves should... Oh my god. Slaves should just shut up and listen to their master's orders. In the future, you're going to work for my company. Of course it's going to be a sweatshop. But your future will be secured. Even slowpokes like you can easily work. If it's your first part... Uh, if it's your first part-time job, then your senior employees will tell you what to do. You will be working for 13 hours every day. And will be paid by minimum wage. There will be 4 hours of unpaid overtime. The constraint time might be long, but I will give you a day off per week. A day off per week. It's such a wonderful thing. But there won't be many people, so it might be quite hard. I think you should die from overworking then. By working, your joints will ache even if even a hospital won't help you. I would like you to feel like you're in a living hell. It will be so fun, you'll want to die. You will be living a life of being my slave from now and forever. So you will be happy forever. Jokes aside, good luck with your toilet cleaning. Thanks for, uh, thanks for changing with me. Kotomi-chan forced me to do her toilet cleaning and walked away. I would shove a broom in, in her throat. Just grab a broom, just shove it down her throat. <gasps> Usa! Usa is a nationwide common save point. Care to save? Yes! Saved. It's time for outside activities. We exercise our body and have fun. Sadly, I'm not good at sports. Oh, so tiring. It's outside activities, Mitaro. You don't like them either, right? Let's ditch this class. I know a good place to have fun. You should come with me. Here, here. It's like on, on the edge of a cliff and she pushes me off. I bet. Guess not. This way, this way! I think this might be like an ending. Oh no, never mind. Teacher said not to go there. Let's go back, Kotoni-chan. It's okay, because I decided it. And Miss Ayano isn't really scary when she gets angry. She should get fired for not checking on the students properly. Whoa, look, look! Look over there! It's a great cliff, right? Oh my god, I called it! <laughs> Don't you think it's scary and thrilling? If you fall from here, you will die for sure, yeah? There won't be any problems if Miss Ayano comes here. Hey, Mitaro-kun. You know, you know, it's just the two of us here. 
Can you feel your heart throbbing? Feeling hor- Oh my god. Feeling horny? Or do you feel like you just want to do it here? If you need a cute girl, she's right here, see? How old do you think I am? I'm a lolly that every- I'm a lolly that everyone loves. Take me. No, I'm good. I'm good for life. Did you get nervous? Sorry, it was Kotomi-chan. If I keep doing these things, you will like- Will you like me? But I don't want to hang out with a person who makes a fool of people. Say something, Mitaron. Don't be silent, I'll cut your dick off. <laughs> oh, I remembered. So, do you know Mitaro? Your dad and mom are criminals, are they? I heard the teachers talking about it. Do you know what criminals are? There are people who have done bad things and got captured by the cops. Do you know what the bad thing they did is? I don't know. <laughs> so you don't know? What a poor boy. Then I will tell you. Your mother is a killer. Hey, did you get surprised, Mitaro? You didn't know that, did you? Oh, I know. Why don't you live with your father? Is it because you ran away? <laughs> Having a wife that is a criminal isn't great, right? It's like you see them on TV sh Uh, yeah, it's like you see them on TV shows. You weren't told such an important- You weren't told such an important thing? Maybe you're getting fooled. That's why you move to a new house often, right? Your mom was so scared of being talked about by the by the people, right? Hey, is it really true? Kotomi wants to know more. Your mom is like a wimp, or a loser, or a cheater. She's a messy piece of shit. Running away like that is worse than being a loser. I mean, you are a child born from a criminal, right? Are you going to do something bad too? Yeah, I'm gonna push you off this cliff. Your family are all pieces of shit, real shit. They don't have the right to live. <laughs> Kill. What? Dump. Kotomi fell down from the cliff. It's not something you can call an accident. I think she won't survive this. I... I really became a killer. Out of fear, I ran away. Just like running from a monster, I ran out of the kindergarten. I don't care about the school bus. I don't need it. After running a long distance, I was so tired that I started to walk. But then, I bumped into someone. Teacher? Um... Mitaro... There is something you can't tell mom, right? Bad end. Blood tells. Wait, what? Um. It, oh, okay. You deserve that. The innocence of a child is frightening. That's why. That's why horrible malice. It grew stronger and stronger towards the boy who recently moved. I know that I wasn't really doing such a thing on purpose. 
I could only express my feeling with awful language and violence. My feelings changed each time. I couldn't control myself. My feelings didn't want to show themselves. They didn't want to move. Just waiting, wait, just wanting and waiting to die. I couldn't tell anyone. I was suffering and I couldn't make it disappear with my intentions. I have to be up happy. I have to smile. I can't break the atmosphere. I didn't want to hurt anyone's feelings, but I couldn't stop myself. If this pain was going to continue on and on. I just wanted to break everything. Even if I scream and go crazy in a small room all by myself, no one would care. I wanted the current I wanted the courage to jump out of that window. If I wasn't allowed to go back or do anything and get tied up, I would like my memories to be gone. I didn't want to show my real self. I wanted to erase myself. Yeah, I might play right into her game. Fuck. Okay. Got to save? I already saved. Okay. Let's get the other ending. How many endings are there? I should probably check. Um. from Mixor. Damn. I completely forgot that there was an Ayano in Mixor. <laughs> I really wish I was a Way to skip this. get angry a bit even if i try this hard you won't get angry at least once well whatever i don't have an interest in you anyway you should get killed by this real world i'm just joking hey do you know why i say mean things to you this much tell me it's because i want you to care about me I like you. That's why I say mean things to you. You're so nice that so you won't understand. I returned home. I controlled myself not to cry. I wanted to meet mom as soon as possible. Yeah, that is I enough for me. I I don't know how I missed that. 
Welcome back, Mitaro. How was school? Wait, no, that's... Wait, no, that's Ma. Ne wait. Oh, wait, never mind. She looks exactly the same. That's good to hear. You ate all your lunch clean. Good boy. Wait, is that... Wait, no. Hold up. Is the... Is the mom... She's from another game, right? I swear she is. She looks ex... Uh... Oh! Is she... Fun. Is she from... Is she Mikoto? No shit, Sherlock! Yeah! She's Mikoto! Oh fuck! So the teacher is Ayano from Mixor and this is Mikoto from Mikoto Niki. Oh shit, wait. That's good to hear. You ate all your lunch clean, good boy. You look tired. I guess you had a lot of fun. I made your favorite rice omelets. Oh, Mitaro? What is it? Did something happen at school? <laughs> it's going to be fine. He'll be alright. Good boy, good boy. True end, mom. I love how interconnected all these games are. Because I like mom. I will take care of her, for dad too. That's why I have to be stronger than who I am now. I... I will make mom happy. When you grow up, I will tell you everything. About the crime I committed. Why dad isn't here. So... So please forgive me. Mitaro-kun. I will live strong. I will, so please. Look over for me and Mitaro. Yeah, that, yeah, so I don't know. I didn't realize because in Mixor she has, like, her hair is down, but here she has it, like, tied up. So that's why I didn't notice, because I'm stupid. Oh, wait. There's Mikoto. I think these are the only two endings. God damn, this music is so good. Um, yeah, only two endings. <laughs> 